I remember I come out here about seven years ago. It was UFC 100. And it was the oldest... What was it? Uh, it was a big deal. They actually shut the town down. And if you've never been to Vegas, um, to like expos and conventions and stuff, Mandalay Bay had the largest fucking convention center. I apologize for cursing. Though. I've been in a gym and kind of around some... <laughs> I'm training for a fight, you know what I mean? Um, but this part over here, this wasn't even built. I mean, they just had UFC 200, and they're, I think, on UFC 205 or 206 now. But I came here with my dreams. Born and raised in, you know, Oklahoma City. I wasn't raised in Oklahoma City, like, right between the Oklahoma border. And it's funny because this is that how things have switched is that everybody always thinks Vegas is fight capital of the world. And you know, sometimes they host the fights here, but the truth is this. If you actually want, like, an athlete, go to Oklahoma. Oklahoma has more casinos. They do more business than Vegas does. You know, tribal casinos and stuff, though. So as I look now, it's kind of crazy, though, how, like, life, you know, works because natives are ranked number one. Uh, we did 30 billion last year in gaming. Uh, 28, 28 and a half billion went to uh, Macau, which is a tiny island off the side of China. And then uh, Vegas did like 5.8. That's why like restaurants, nightclubs, um, what is it? Uh, what else? Expos, conventions, and then uh, people get married here. But that's what Vegas really is, though. But it's kind of crazy because they still have the big buildings here and all that stuff and they're trying to pay the bills though but you know it's really intimidating for a guy like me that that's from two convenience stores and one stoplight you know to see all these big buildings and look down this big long ass you know strip you know and what's crazy is because over here is you know where everybody flies in so you see like you know private flights coming in you see you know airplanes coming in and just you know, internationally, though. And then down here, you have, like, you know, there's more casinos down here. But, you know, fast forward to today, I get the opportunity to, you know, be a part of be a part of my dreams and part of my goals and, you know, get to see people. And, you know, every now and then I'll come here on a Friday and a Saturday night. And, um, you know, there's a lot of electricity in the air, though. But come December 2nd. Uh, the Hard Rock, you know, I'm going to be fighting, so be good. Anyway, I need to get back to my training. You guys have a good one, all right? Later.